Do you think artificial intelligence is all about crazy robots who just want to take over our world? Are super smart robots really the future of our world? Good morning everyone. My topic is can machines think? I've always been interested in programming and technology. When I was in grade 3, I wanted to make an e-card for my mom. So she taught me basic programming in Scratch. Ever since, I've been really interested in everything technology related like programming and robotics. I used to think that AI and robotics were the same thing. Until I went for the AI camp. about. AI is basically just any program or machine that tries to mimic human behavior. Robots are not necessarily intelligent. They usually perform whatever function they've been programmed to do by humans. If a robot was artificially intelligent, it would be able to make its own intelligent decisions based on experience, reinforcement learning, and neural networks. In the UAE AI camp, we also learned how machines are able to learn by playing with this robot that's called a Cosmo. Every time you play with it, it learns a new skill and the more you play with it, the more intelligent it will be the next time you play with it. We also learned that AI is used in many fields every day, like facial recognition systems, voice assistants like Siri and Alexa, chess games, and even to recommend videos to you on YouTube. As a music lover, I was also naturally drawn to the lovely music that's created by AI. I found all of this really interesting, and once the camp was over, I wanted to know more. So, my cousin brother suggested the book by Alan Turing, Computing Machinery and Intelligence. In the book, Alan Turing proposed the question, can machines think? He also proposed the Turing test, which determines whether a machine is intelligent or not. In the test, there's a human judge who asks a question to a human and to a machine. If the machine's answers are indistinguishable from the human's answers, the machine is considered intelligent. Alan Turing had estimated that by 2000, computers with 100 MB data would pass the test easily. But till date, machines have only been able to pass the test by tricking the judges. For example, in 1964, Eliza passed the test by answering the questions with the judges' questions modified a little bit. Now, you know a little more about AI. What do you think? Can machines think? <laughs>